Okay, good morning. Ang topic natin today ay MS Success. With this, gagawa tayo ng simple address book from scratch. So start guys, click lang yung MS Access. Press the enter key. Maximize ko lang yung window. Then, dun tayo sa blank desktop database, click lang isang beses. And dito guys, ito yung location kung saan nyo sisave yung uh, database nyo. So let's name it as address book. Then you just click the create button. Okay, by default, meron kami makikita ng table 1. Pwede nyo itong uh, marename, paano. So dun mula tayo sa design view. So, let's name it as TPL TPL stands for Table Contacts. It's up to you guys. Ganun gusto nyo yung pangalan nyo. Click OK. Then, meron tayo yung tinatawag na primary key. Meron kami itong susi dito sa left side. Yung primary key um, analogy para itong uh, plate number ng sasakyan. This would be your unique values. Okay, so lagyan natin dito last name. Type short text. First name. Short text. We have the address. And we have the mobile number. So dito guys, pwede tayo mamili ng... Short text lang din siya. Since hindi naman natin siya gagamitin sa competition. We have the email address. Okay. So we're done with the field names. Pwede nyo na ma-save to. Just click the uh, X button here. Then you want to save it. Yes. So meron tayong uh, table para sa ating contact. Double click. Pag in-double click nyo ito, pwede na yung mag-input ng record. So, let's name uh, Rizal. First name is Jose. Address is uh, Laguna. Mobile number. Sample ko lang yan. Then, Rizal. At Google.com Next, Bonifacio. Andres. Dito lang yung address ni Sample Google number and number Then we have Andres at Google Okay, we're, we're done with these two records Click lang natin yung X button So, automatic naka-save na yun, guys Double-click lang to Makikita nyo na yung records natin Okay, next, we're done with the table. Pwede na tayo gumawa ngayon ng query. So, click nyo lang yung create. Okay, guys, para mabilis, pagpapilin lang natin yung for, uh, query wizard. So, simple query wizard. Okay. Para mabilis ulit, click lang natin ito. Saan naman gagaling yung uh, query natin? Siyempre, sa table contacts. Ito yun. Tapos, Click natin lahat. Next. Then, uh, table contact query. Okay, para may code tayo. Finish. Ngayon, para makita nyo itong query na to, double click lang. Hindi nyo lalabas yung laman ng table natin. So, right click lang kayo dito, design view. Para may edit nyo siya. Sa criteria guys, query means uh, we ask question, ano? So, let's see. Gusto nyo makita lahat ng records all about Rizal. Ito lang sa criteria, Rizal. Then, run the query. So, makikita nyo lang si Rizal. Okay? Balik sa design view. Uh, what if gusto nyo lahat start with letter R, gumamit ng star or asterisk, or ito yung pagkakot na wild cards, double quotation mark, and the query. So, result pa rin. 
Okay po. So, yun ang gamit ng query. So, design view. Ito siya. Then, I'll close it. Yes. Save siya. So, we're done with the query. Then, gagawa naman tayo ng form. Create. Para mabilis, sunulit tayo sa form wizard. Click. Saan so, gagaling yung record? Galing siya sa table. Quantrox. Click lang to. Next. Then, namili kayo ng design. So, pili natin justified. It's up to you guys. Next. Then, let's name it as form. FRM stands for form. Form contacts. Then, finish. So, ito yung form natin. So, since meron na tayong form, guys, pwede na tayong dito ngayon mag-input. So, what will happen is lahat ng ipapasok natin na record dito, or record, automatic papasok yun dito sa table na contacts. So, let's add a new record. Ano mag-add? Click lang to. New, new blank record. Sabihin natin dito, uh, last name is uh, Mabini. Then, the culinary. Address, halimbawa, Batangas. Mobile number. Whatever it is. Then, app linario at google.com New record. So, automatic. Pag new record kayo, automatic papasok yun dito sa table natin. Next, uh, last name, Aguinaldo. Then, uh, Emilio. Address is Cavite. Mobile number, any number if you want to. Email address, <coughs> Emilio at google.com Okay, let's close it. Wala, bago ko i-close to, uh, let's change this. Para mabago nyo yan, punta kayo sa design view. So, let's name it. Personal information. Okay, tignan nyo guys sa uh, design. Pwede nyo baguhin dito yung mga, nandito naman yung mga, uh, what you call this one, properties nya. So, palitan nyo lang. Okay, I'll close it. Yes, save it. So, meron tayo yung form. Pwede natin makita sya. Ayun, nabago na sya dito. Okay, I'll close it guys. I'll close it. So, we have the table contacts. We have the uh, contacts query. We have the form. Then, gagawa naman tayo ngayon ng reports. Create lang. Then, tingnan nyo lang yung uh, report wizard para mabilis. So, magagaling yung records. Uh, ang source natin is yung table contacts. Next. So, dinag ko lang lahat. Next. Okay. Wala, back tayo. Uh, yeah. So, next lang. Then, next lang ulit. Gusto natin siya yung last name, yung ascending order. So, naka-sort siya. Ayan, ang gusto kong style, columnar, mamili kayo, tabular. So, ang gusto ko is tabular, yung naka-portrait. And let's name it, uh, since report yan, lagyan natin ng abbreviation na RPT for report. Then finally finish. Then we have now the report. If you want to change the attendance, design view, let click lang doon. Okay. Then close it, guys. Save it, yes. So, complete na tayo. We have the table. Ito yun. Napansin nyo kanina, nagdagdag ako ng dalawang records. We have Mabini. Ito, nag-appear sa table. Query. Ito yung kanina. So, kung gusto yung makita yung query, you go to design view. 
So, maglagay lang kayo ng uh, criteria dito. Ito pa naman guys, sa'yo yun ang R. Gusto nyo lahat ng address starts with letter uh, B. Ito yun ang B asterisk. Then, run the query. So, malalabas dito sa address natin, Malintuak and Matangas. Which is Malipasya na bili. Okay? I'll save it. Then, close it. And, guys, kumulat na tayo. We go back to the form. Ayan. Ngayon, under ng form, pwede tayo mag-search ng record. So, dito sa maliit na box na to, yun lang yung hinahanap yung record. Let's see, Rizal, enter. So, lalabas na siya dito. If you want to look for uh, Mabini, just type. Ayan, automatic mag, uh, maghahanap na yung uh, program natin. Okay? If you want to look for Aguinaldo, just type it. Ayan. So, we have now a simple address book gamit ang MS Access. So, yun ang tandaan nyo. We have two objects sa loob. We have the table. We have the query. We have the form. And we have the report. Okay, that's it for the day. Thank you guys for listening and watching. I hope na may natutunan kayo. Nga pala, salamat din sa mga subscribers ko. And salamat din sa mga nag-view ng mga video na ginawa ko. Okay, that's it for the day guys. Ingat po tayo palagi. Thank you and bye-bye.